Hey guys, today we're gonna to be taking some medium format portraits on the Mamiya RZ67 with the 90 millimeter lens from the RB67. I definitely am not known as a portrait photographer and it's not something that I would really consider myself great at, but the one thing I do know is that you have to be comfortable with your subject, so that's why I've asked this good looking man here, <laughs> who also doubles as my best friend Alex, uh, to just come out today at this botanical garden. So we're gonna take some portraits on portrait 800 and portrait 400 and see what we can make happen. Okay, I'm gonna crank those out. Yeah, I was in red. I know a lot of living in the middle of nowhere. Yeah, and at the same time, pretty to kind of like hurt. We've never been to this area over here, so we're gonna go check. Let's just check it out. Also, this camera is really good. Like if uh, if you're in a place taking photos that you feel unsafe, if you hit somebody in the head with this, they're done. Absolutely done. A shout out to this camera doubling as a weapon if you ever feel unsafe. <laughs> you get a shot of me on this uh, big red chair. <laughs> that would actually be really funny. We just found this absolutely amazing scene that we just couldn't pass up. So we're gonna spend $2 on a frame of portrait to give you guys the portraits that you deserve. All right, ready? schooler or not a high schooler but a little bit older and tumblr was still a thing we used to come down to these greenhouses and take some deep artistic photos of greenery and such but i don't think you can go in anymore I think, I think like a good technique is to like hold under, maybe. This is Evan's camera, he's gonna teach me how to hold it better. I usually kind of like cradle it like that. I like that. Yeah, so I focus with the left and have that on trigger. Do you still feel like sometimes you don't have it like good? Or no, you're pretty confident now? I've gotten more confident. The yeah. first time that I used it though, it was, it was tough because it was yeah. so heavy versus anything else that I shot with. The young king Willem Verbeek is texting me while we're trying to finish this video. Yes, Willem, it is okay if you come to Tennessee. towards me just ever so slightly. down below. Thank you, Ed. <laughs> Alex, you can do one right here, like if you like lean your head up against your hand. Three. Like right here. 
Yeah, come into the light a little bit more. Come. Seen that landscape all day? You might have. Oh no. We shot that landscape all day. Every single photo we just shot was landscape. <laughs> Alright, this is blast it. Yeah, take one and portrait. So we just shot three rolls and I shot every single photo in landscape orientation. So I'm pretty bummed about that. Everybody's gonna comment and be like, yo, he doesn't wrap this, I don't know. But medium format film is really expensive and we worked really hard to out on this video, so. You getting what we shot, y'all. Carrying my baby. Who takes portraits in landscape? Dude, it's a new trend. Let me tell you, no one. Alex is going to lay down. So you know I'm those memes, people dropping their phone in their face? Exactly, so I'm gonna try and like come on top of him with the angle, but if I drop this camera on his face, then he will die. And so, we'll see how it goes. No, definitely one of our worst ideas we've ever had. Um...